be able to fill that role in the same way. Um, and then finally, we have, according to ESPN, we, we have the Browns are looking to move on from Baker Mayfield officially. He said the Seahawks are out, but they are wanting to get rid of Baker Mayfield, probably by trade. Uh, so yeah, so the first part of this podcast will be diving into Baker Mayfield. So uh, we're going to go through these corny little uh, transition things for um, the podcast. We'll see how this goes. Uh, tell me if you like it or not in the comments below. Um, so yeah, uh, we're going to get into Baker Mayfield. So I'm just going to talk about like uh, how this whole thing went down in the first place and trying to make sense of it. I know there's tons of videos on it, but we'll just go quickly through this and then look at the new stuff and then get my opinion on it. Um, so... I didn't. I wasn't really a fan of Baker Mayfield personality-wise as a leader when he first came in, so I'm not really surprised that like all this all this stuff is uh coming uh, forward. Not like for like an like bad stuff about him, but like everything's going down this way. Um, so yeah, uh, they basically, from what he says, they basically told him that. Uh, he's going to be staying this year or something along those lines and then they went behind his back and went and got Deshaun Watson is from what he says but I mean he says he says he says whatever at this point um so yeah so now they want to move on from him um I initially thought they wanted to keep him in case uh what will likely be a Deshaun Watson suspension I'm guessing which would make a lot of sense. That was why they would want to keep him in the first place. So, yeah, I'm a little confused there. But I guess he doesn't want to play for them anymore. Makes sense. I'm not sure what team actually wants him. Um, the Colts makes sense because Matt Ryan's getting older and you get a younger quarterback that can actually play. Um, the Lions can make some sense, but I think they'd rather want to stick with Jared Goff and that, if that doesn't work, uh, they can get a better pick for next draft. Um, I want to say no, 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 no. Uh, I don't know who else would want him right now. In all honesty, Philly, but that doesn't make any sense. They got like a stuffed quarterback room right now. Um, I cannot think of another team off the top of my head. Pittsburgh, but they just draft Kenny Pickett. Uh, would say the Texans, but I feel like I think they're going to stick with Davis Mills this year, honestly. I'm not sure if they drafted a I don't know. But we'll, um, so yeah, seems like he's stuck in a pretty bad position right now. Um, I guess feel bad for him? I don't know. Uh, this is just a very sticky situation that I'm sure no one wants to be a part of. <laughs> 